Hey there, it's Lucas back at it again with another episode of Mindset Mondays for Musicians. And as it currently started to rain, I thought I'll get inside and share with you one of the topics that is very close to my heart and I'm sure a nerve wracking experience for many of you as well. And that is gaining confidence as a musician, whether that's in a studio, on a stage or in front of a camera like this, whether it's your first time hitting the record button or the hundredth, those red light jitters can sometimes get to the best of us. So let's break it down and transform that studio time from daunting to empowering. And also as I'm in the middle of the jungle, if you'll hear any noises, then that's that. And first, let's address the elephant in the room, the pressure we put on ourselves to nail that perfect take. It's like we expect to just step into the studio and suddenly channel every music legend ever. Spoiler alert, even they didn't get it right on the first try. Remember, recording is a process, not a one-shot deal. And here is a golden nugget for you. Start by setting the stage for a no-pressure environment. This means acknowledging that not every take needs to be perfect. In fact, some of the most iconic recordings were born from mistakes that added character and authenticity. So let's aim for genuine expression, not perfection. Now, on to building our confidence muscle. Just like warming up before playing, make sure you get into the right headspace before you hit record. This could mean doing few relaxation exercises, visualizing your success, or even recording a couple of throwaway takes just to shake off the nerves. It's all about creating a comfortable space where you're free to experiment and to express yourself. Remember the old saying, practice makes perfect? Well, in our case, it's more practice makes confident. The more family you are with your material, the more at ease you'll feel when recording. Spend time with your piece until you know it inside out. Not just in your fingertips, but in your soul, just deep down. That familiarity breeds confidence. So let's not forget about the power of positive self-talk and swapping out those I can't do this moments with I'm getting better with every take. Your mindset plays a huge role in how you perform and talking down to yourself in the real time as you're trying to get that perfect take is not going to really help. One thing that can help in order to get into the right headspace is to do your unique rituals before hitting that record button. Every musician has one. If you don't, then let's create one straight away. It can be brewing a fresh pot, cup of tea, playing your favorite song to get into the groove, meditating for a few minutes, or even having a laugh with your bandmates or friends. Find that ritual that senses you, that reminds you of the joy of creating music. This isn't just about relaxing, it's about reminding yourself why you're here. You're here because you love music and recording is just another way to express that love. Embrace it with all its imperfections and surprises because sometimes the take you are about to delete, the one that you stumbled a bit or the emotions crack in your voice, turns out to be the most authentic and impactful. These are the moments that listeners connect with. It's not about the technically perfect executions all the time. It's all about the emotion and rawness and the realness of the performance. Give yourself permission to explore these moments, to leave some imperfections in your recordings. They are not flaws, they are fingerprints of your uniqueness. I'll always remind myself Johnny Cash version of Hurt and those string buzzing imperfections that just makes the entire song a masterpiece. I love that song. Another important key aspect as well is the environment you choose to record in. Whether it's a professional studio, your bedroom or a makeshift setup in your basement, make it a space that inspires you and makes you feel good. Surround yourself with objects that spark creativity, maybe pictures of your musical heroes, a poster of your favorite band or even just having your favorite guitar picks scattered all around. These little things can make a big difference in how you feel about the space and by extension how confident you feel when recording. All in all, remember that every musician's journey includes moments of doubt, especially when faced with the red, red recording light. But it's these very moments that push us to grow, to step out of our comfort zones and to discover what we're truly capable of. Your recordings are not just tracks, they're milestones on your musical journey. Each one reflects where you were at that given moment in time, both as an artist and as a person. Every musician walks their own path. That's why comparing your chapter one to someone else's chapter 20 is a no-go. 
So instead, focus on your own unique journey and mainly celebrate your progress. So anytime when you do something that was nerve wracking or challenging, make sure you acknowledge it and give credit to yourself. I used to be very shy in front of a camera and to some extent I still probably am. But every time I finish recording now, I go, yes, awesome, well done. This way I'm releasing dopamines, the happy hormones, and I'm teaching my brain to connect these activities with feeling great afterwards. This naturally makes it easier to get started on them the next time around, as the brain knows I will feel good after, as opposed to finishing with the hard task, talking trash to yourself and resulting in not feeling good about yourself, even though you've just done something that was really challenging to you, which doesn't make sense at all. So make sure to be there for you and support yourself. And there you have it, folks. Remember that confidence is not gained, but earned. So as you work through it, soon you'll find that recording or performing will stop being that high pressure situation that sends your nerves into the red zone. With the right preparation, mindset and a bit of patience, you'll find yourself hitting that record button with confidence and maybe even a bit of excitement. Remember, it's all about progress, not perfection. So just embrace and celebrate the journey. Keep pushing, keep practicing, and most importantly, keep working on believing in yourself. You've got this.